I think we have got a little smile going on. Six weeks old and we're smiling and we're chatting. <laughs> Oh, you are so adorable. Oh. <laughs> Hello. So we're here in Weybridge on the Thames path. As you saw, Jacob is now smiling, six weeks old, and he's smiling, and it's just so adorable. You like it, don't you? I like it. He yeah. doesn't smile as much for me as he smiles for you. Well, no, well, I give him the milk, that's what it's about. <laughs> um, but six weeks also means that I am <clears throat> technically allowed to exercise, obviously, gently. Gently, please. As Nick keeps telling me. <laughs> it's absolutely stunning. It's a beautiful day, a bit crisp, but we're starting a bit of an exercise routine. And it's also a chance for us to really start testing out how good this Phil and Ted's sports buggy is. And I mean, we love the handling already. It's beautiful. Um, so we're just trying to test it out on the on the bumpy terrain. And so far, we're absolutely loving it. Yeah. So um, if you are interested in this particular buggy, then I will link it down below so you can go and check that out for yourself. But Jacob's obviously keen. Wanna shake the ground? Wanna break away? Let loose. I'm tired. Shout to me and you to write a story. Wanna shape the new? Do you wanna? Do you wanna come along with me? Okay, it's adorable little YouTube hat. So this was a gift from YouTube for Jacob, and we absolutely love it, don't we, Jacob? With your hiccups. What do you think? Yeah. Okay. Uh, <laughs> yesterday we went to see Danielle, the photographer from um, Bright Apple photography who did our uh, maternity shoot and our baby photo shoot and we picked up our order which is our photo book so Jacob's got his first book that's you my darling uh oh uh oh hang on intervention okay okay it's all right and um, so we got that and we also got a canvas for the bedroom and we got lots and lots of mounted photos which we're going to send out to family members and some we'll put on our walls hey Jacob what were you just saying Jacob's talking. What's that? Oh yeah. Oh, you're tired. It's been a busy morning, hasn't it? And we ain't got nothing, gotta do something, get it right. Gonna keep on running, grab the fun and live it live. And tomorrow's fine. Hey Jacob. Jacob's got wind. Now, some of you may or may not know, I have an online course for pronunciation to help people sound um, British English, to speak with a clearer RP accent, or just have generally clearer enunciation. And um, I keep in touch with a lot of, excuse you, I keep, a lot of, I keep in touch with a lot of those students via Skype calls and um, voice messages to help them with their pronunciation through the course. And just providing some feedback to a student this morning, Jacob let this one rip. So there's a lot of short vowels that you need to work on. <laughs> he certainly brightens up my day. Just about managed to put him down for five seconds without him screaming. Today I'm going to try and do some Bella and Beans filming because we recently put out a video, the Baby Shark song, which has accumulated a lot of views in a very short space of time. So we want to kind of continue that success by putting out a Christmas Baby Shark song. How do you feel about Bella and Beans today? I might even put him on camera if he's willing, but I doubt. Baby shark do 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 baby shark do 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 baby shark do 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 baby shark mummy shark do 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 so to, <laughs> so to keep him calm Nick constantly tells me to try and put him in a swing around the house but this is his reaction he also throws up every time I put him in it and as soon as I put him in it he's just like He just 
next move to the key is pulling away when want to be in it. Now despite Jacob not really liking tummy time, we have been persisting with putting him down for at least a minute each day on his tummy. And it started paying off because this week he managed to turn his head from one side to the other. Bless him. He's going to be crawling in no time. I love you. What's going on with your leggies over here? Oh, Jake, have you doing so well? How are you? Oh. I'm a friendly lover. I'll get you one to do a friendly lover. Oh, well done, baby. Well done. Unfortunately, as you can see from those clips, his skin is getting really bad. And actually that baby acne has seemed to develop into a cradle cap, I believe it is. Um, it started really dry on his forehead and now it's come down into his eyebrows and into his head. He's starting to lose his hair. So I think he's lost a couple of inches, a couple of inches, a couple of centimeters from the front of his hairline, which used to be very low. And now it's going back. I don't know if he's gonna lose all his hair. Um, and it looks really sore. The doctors have just said, look, loads of cream, as much cream as you can, and um, no bubble bath or soaps when I'm washing him. So just water to wash him and lots of cream as often as I can. Now, within a day or two, his eyebrows, actually, the crust on his eyebrows started to turn orange, which is perfect timing for Halloween. So guess what we decided to dress him as? A pumpkin. Happy Halloween, Jacob.